Friday, my homeboy from Hawaii sent the uh, this old fat boy two pill down and uh, said he had a problem with it doing some low wattage. He said it was doing about 200 watts on his meter. Let's see, I got it on 14 and a half volts. I'm on a 500 watt slug. Okay, so looking at the peak wattage. Since that's what he was looking at too. Looking at the middle scale here, one uh, the 10 is 100 watts. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh. Yep. A little bit under 200 watts. Oh, yeah, oh. Input reflect looks good. But uh, I see a couple of things that uh, I'm going to do. I'm going to take these right here off. Just ain't a must, just something that can help a little bit. Throw you a metal on. Thinking about taking these power wires off right here too and getting you some a little bit little bigger wire. That's not a must or anything, but I'm going to take, take that attenuator off. A little single line attenuation. And uh, I'm going to check the output reflect too, just to make sure that cap in the back still is good and all that good stuff. So we'll be back, man. We'll see if we can get this thing opened up here and get it rolling. All right, brother. We took the attenuator out and went down to a 1.8. Uh, put your metal on right there. So you now have gained... About a hundred more watts. Alrighty. Bird. Go. Go. Right there, about seventy five bird or so, sixty to seventy five bird. Maybe about 80. Hmm. All right. But of course, you know, this thing's a high drive, so it definitely can use a little bit more drive. All right, so we're going to drive it with the Stickman radio and double our input RMS drive from 4 watts to 8 watts. Now we're getting middle scale. Don't about a hundred and fifty bird. Okay, P P. Do four hundred and fifty watts P P. I say that is a increase, my friend. Do. What's this thing talking though? If I just get out there and shoot a little bit of skip, letting the mop fly for gatekeeper GK Cruz and out here around the northeast end of Georgia, transmitting in this dummy load, heating up the oil, letting it boil. Get down, get down, get down, get. <laughs> All right, man. Of course, if you took this variable right here off, it'd gain just a little bit more output. Anything extra in RF, RF has to go through. You're going to have a little bit of DB loss. But I think you're going to be using this as a driver so that variable could be of use to you. If you was not using this as a driver, you do not need that, bar none, with a 2879 2 pill. And uh, if I put it up on a, the unregulated supply over there and Put up a driver to it or something like that. Of course, we could get 200, 300 bird out of this thing, but I ain't gonna do all that, man. It's got a variable on it. That variable means, hey, I can only drive so much through it. So I would just use a radio with this. I would not hook up a driver or anything like that. All right, big brother. I was thinking about doing a power wire upgrade, but you know, you didn't ask for one. I'm trying to get out of doing things people don't ask for. <laughs> 
But I do got a lot of work to do too, and I don't really think a power work is gonna do really anything for you. I mean, this is probably 10 gauge wire. I mean, that's fine. That's fine. All right, but but you you could do a, a power work gray if you wanted to yourself. Really ain't gonna do much good for this. You, you, you shouldn't see any increase of wattage. But uh, all right, man. Well, we got it back up and rolling for you. I'll get the top back on there, man, and get this thing uh, shipped back to the Hawaii area. Mr. Gatekeeper said it. Bye, bye, bye.